Hi everybody, here we are again. I need to Cooper's Lager here to talk about it. So it's a Cooper's Kitten Kilo beer. All of the DIY range, that's the label. It's got instructions on the back. They do have this peel off, I don't do it. It, it rips a strip out from the middle. I just take the label off the can completely. Because the can. So, let's have a look at it. Polished clear. You can see through that. A light golden colour. Yellow to gold. Flash the torch. Facts and figures. So, starting gravity was 1.046 at 22 degrees C. Finishing gravity, quite low, 1.006 at 20 degrees C. Not worth messing with the figures for that 2 degrees drop in temperature. Gave an approximate ABV of 5.43478261%. That's approximate, of course. Price of the kit was £12.95, plus about 65p for sugar. That's £13.60. And I reused my SO4 yeast, as usual. Wacky band, where's that come from? No idea. I'll put it there so it will stick to the book again. I'm going to put the book on top of it. So it's probably there. That's where it's come from. As you can see, it doesn't hold a head. It doesn't... It barely holds a ring. Now, this is off my pressure barrel, my poly pin, as it actually is. So it doesn't... It serves at about room temperature. A degree or so below room temperature doesn't have too much carbonation it's the beer is nicely carbonated but it's not fizzy like a lager normally is it has that slight carbonation on the tongue so it is a properly conditioned beer maybe not lager style don't know if I could get it to fizzy I'd have to chill it I have thought of a plan for chilling a whole barrel don't know if it'll work we'll see if I ever get around to it but it's quite a nice beer was it five I've forgotten the percentage 5.4% even more approximate than the first approximation 5.4 so it's a bit woohoo tastes reasonably alright you can it is starting to get that slight alcohol taste especially because it's a lager so it's fairly light on the flavour anyway, you do just get that, I've just realised what it is, there is this, this subtle flavour which I couldn't pick out and I think it's the alcohol, normally you can't taste, uh, well, on a 4.5% four, four beer I can't taste the alcohol, you know that you've had a few after you've had a few but it's very light multi flavour a little bit of sweetness and some quite nice gentle bittering that's about it yeah nothing else really a bit like a lager 
Right, so would I buy it again? Probably not. It's not my style of beer. I like something a little bit darker with more flavour. But that's all right, and at 5.4%, you're not going to need too many of them. Right, like, comment, subscribe. See you next time. Cheers. Bye. Almost forgot, I was going to mention the fact that we've been to Pirate Mania again. Sometimes put footage up, sometimes don't. I took the camera this year. Some idiot forgot to put the memory card in it. So we've got no footage. I've got a couple of photos. I'll probably post them up at the end. So, yeah. See you next time. Cheers. Bye. Train line window stops Should I survive?